Do you know about the health benefits of drinking tart cherry juice every day, but you're not happy with the price of it at the grocery store? I was shocked at how expensive it is. So I decided to make my own this year and I found a new gadget. I just got it and I used it for the first time to make our own cherry juice. And then I canned it so we can have it all year long. Let me show you how, because you can use this for more than just cherries. Well, here's the gadget. It's a steamer juice extractor. I found out about this from my mom actually. And it's three parts, the bottom you put the water, in the middle part, you put the collector. This is where you're gonna collect the juice and it runs in a hose down to a pot. The top is a steamer basket, which I'm gonna fill with all of these cherries after we give them a wash. And you can fill it all the way up to the top and then put the lid on it. At this point, we need to go ahead and get the heat started. And I'm gonna turn it on high, let this water boil, and I'm clamping the hose shut so that we don't have anything leak out while the steam does its magic and it opens up all of the cherries, allowing the juice to run out. And as it fills up in a pot, we're gonna use that pot to heat it up. When I'm finished, I'm gonna close it off, set the steamer aside, and I'm gonna get started with canning supplies. My funnel and my canning lids and rings are in this pot, and the juice is getting hot in this pot. Once everything's hot and ready to go, I'm gonna go ahead and ladle it into my jars. And I was able to get almost six jars out of this, five that I'm gonna can and one that we just put in the refrigerator because it wasn't quite full. After I wipe down all of the jars, I'm gonna go ahead and put my lids and rings on and just hand tighten them. They don't need to be cranked down too hard. Now I'm putting them in my canner, but you don't have to pressure can these, so any pot will do. You just need to put them into water, make sure it's fully covered with water, put the lid on, and you just need to hot water bath them for about 15 minutes. When they're sealed and cool, remove the rings for storage.